guys, today I'm going to share my experience getting a Brazilian blowout for the first time. So I actually got my hair done at the Smooth Bar in Carmel Mountain Ranch, which is located in San Diego. Um, it's not too far of a drive from LA, so I don't really mind going out there and I will continue to go out there for my treatments just because I like their salon so much and I think their prices and the way that how their professionalism is worth the drive to me. And to be perfectly honest, I really knew nothing about the Brazilian blowout coming in, but luckily the stylist that I worked with was very knowledgeable and explained to me what was going to happen. And even before we started the treatments, she actually talked to me what I was interested in doing with my hair and definitely pinpointed what treatment would be best for those results. So for me, what I wanted is a reduction in my actual natural curl pattern of my hair. And I also wanted defrizzing. And so we decided on the Brazilian blowout together. I did get a keratin treatment before at the same salon in the past, and I made a video on that, which I will link in the down bar below, which I also enjoyed, but I really wanted to try the Brazilian blowout only because I hear such good things about it, right? And it's like one of the most popular treatments for people to have done on their hair. Oh, and just letting you guys know, before I actually went in, I think I washed my hair a day before because I knew they were gonna wash it anyway there, and I didn't want to wash it the day of because like I said, they're gonna wash it the day of there. Um, so yeah, I went one day, without washing my hair when I showed up there and that was perfectly fine, didn't affect the results at all. I think after I got it done, just in case I waited two days to wash my hair again, even though you can wash it right away, just to be on the safe side and um, just because so much labor was put into my hair, I decided to wait. Honestly, getting these treatments done on my hair at first, I didn't think that I would ever be one to spend that much money, like I said, because I'm on a student budget on my hair. So how the treatment itself worked is I remember she washed my hair and then she put the product on and then I believe we, I can't remember if we blow dried it first and then we, I know we washed it twice so then we washed it again and then we flat ironed it out. I believe that's how it went. So we washed it, um, we took my hair back, we, blow, we applied product, we blow dried it, we washed it again and then we flat ironed it and I will show you guys the pictures of that too which is, it should be the thumbnail and my hair looked so pretty that day, it was so soft, like just to the touch it felt so much better than it usually does. So guys, this is my hair before anything. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna show you the before and after of my hair. So this is my hair directly after the treatment. This is my hair after the first wash. It looks pretty straight and this is literally nothing done to it. No product, nothing. Just the care therapy shampoo and conditioner. Okay guys, this is three hours later and this is what my hair looks like. You could definitely tell that the curl pattern is decreased, which I wanted. She said it would go down max two curl patterns and I definitely see that. It honestly, like I could just wear my hair like this and be good to go, but I'm probably still gonna straighten it. I just wanted to show you guys how it looks. Definitely not frizzy, which is a huge difference. And I'll show you guys when I blow dry it and straighten it, what it looks like. Ignore the face mask, so I'm gonna show you guys my hair just without anything in it after the shower. So guys, here's my hair after letting it dry, air dry. And nothing is in it. Sorry, I'm wearing a moisture mask right now. And then I'm gonna time it and see how long it takes me to actually straighten my hair out. I think it looks good just as it is right now, but I will be straightening it right now. So guys, here are the results. It took me 10 minutes. I feel like my hair looks super smooth. I, I am obsessed. Like, I never want my hair to not look like this. It was so easy to straighten, and I just used the Chi, the straightener, and I do use it at a high temperature setting only because I feel like it straightens my hair the best that way, even though I know that's not recommended. And then I just use a wet brush. So here's my hair once again. I'll get close so you guys can see it. And my hair used to be super damaged. Like, it still is pretty damaged, but it's gone a long way. So guys, these are my results one month later, and that is my hair blow dried and it's straightened. So my overall experience and what I do it again is positive so far. Like I said, it's been a little over a month out and I haven't noticed my hair lose its like shine or 
it hasn't been getting frizzy lately, it's super easy to style. What I really enjoy about this treatment too is directly after I get out of the shower, I could blow dry it and it seems like it's cut my blow dry time in half. Usually when I don't have any treatments, it takes me about sometimes up to 30 minutes to blow dry my hair, but with this treatment, it takes me about 10 minutes and even if I don't choose to blow dry it, air drying it takes a lot faster, which I enjoy. And then running a flat iron through my hair, it used to take me around 40 minutes and now it only takes me around, I would say, 15 minutes max to straighten my entire head. And if you guys saw the before and after pictures, my hair used to be pretty wavy and pretty frizzy, so it would take me a really long time. And another thing that I really like about it is because my hair isn't as frizzy, sometimes I could just blow dry it and head out the door. I don't even straighten it or anything because sometimes it just looks fine just after the blow dry. If you take a brush and blow dry it, it'll blow dry pretty darn straight, which I really enjoy. And that's a huge difference from how my hair used to be. So overall too, um, in order to take care of my hair when I wash it, I do wash it about every three days only because I want the treatment to last as long as possible. Um, and I wash it with the two shampoos that I got at their salon. So the two shampoos and shampoo and conditioner are the care therapy keratin infused moisture conditioner and the Kara therapy moisture shampoo and they're both sulfate free I've used these for when I got the keratin treatment last time I really like these the girl who was doing my hair also gave me a really good tip be careful when you guys buy these online because sometimes if you see them cheap on Amazon or you see them cheap on some websites it's actually not the real product they put other stuff in the bottle who knows what they put in the bottle or sometimes the product is actually expired so just be careful when you're buying it online and I highly recommend just buying it in a salon that you get your hair done at even if it's not this one. Just because you know that you're getting like an authentic product that isn't expired. So like I said, I had a really great experience there. I will tell you guys a little bit about the salon in a minute. Um, another thing that I really noticed is ever since I started getting treatments in my hair, whether it be keratin or now this Brazilian blowout, I've noticed my hair get a lot longer and a lot healthier and less breakage and that's because because my hair is like less frizzy and I'm less inclined to put like a strainer through it a bunch of times like when it used to take me a longer time to straighten my hair I used to just put it on high heat and just keep putting heat on it for like 40 minutes straight but now that I only have to put heat on it for like 10 minutes straight and sometimes I don't even put heat on it at all um, it really lessens that heat damage from my hair and it's able to heal, repair, and grow. Um, if you guys look at some of my older videos, my hair was a lot shorter, um, but now it's a lot longer. I don't dye it anymore. I don't feel the need to do anything crazy and put excessive amounts of heat to it. And I'm really happy about that because I really like long, healthy hair. And I think this is the healthiest and the prettiest my hair has ever been and has ever looked. I really love the way it looks. I'm obsessed with it now. I love wearing it straight. I know some girls like to wear it curly and you totally can. Um, I do like my curls, but I also really like straight, sleek hair on me. So I know when we talk about the price, it could sound a little bit pricey, but just letting you guys know, like I said, I have longer hair and thicker hair, which often makes the price go up by about almost $100 or $50 to $100, I would say on average from the salons I've been to. So definitely keep that in mind. If your hair is not as long as mine and it's not as, you know, giant and thick, then you'll probably get a better price, which is amazing. And this price is already super cheap because places I've been in LA have tried to charge me like upwards of $650 to get this treatment done. And I've definitely said no because I am a college student and I'm on a college student budget so I really like that this place is budget friendly another thing is the service was amazing the girl who actually did my hair her name is Haley and she did an absolutely fantastic job she didn't cut any corners she took her time she didn't rush or she I didn't feel like she was rushed I've been to some salons before where I feel like they're just trying to get me in and out and they don't really care about the quality of my hair um, but in this case, she really took her time and did an amazing job. She helped me take before and after pictures because, you know, I like to see those. Something I also really liked about this treatment is how there was no time where I couldn't wash it and there wasn't any time where I couldn't get my hair wet or go work out right away, which is different because when you get the keratin treatment, you're not supposed to get your hair wet or sweat or anything for, I believe, it's three days. So I really liked how this one was just like you can go about your day directly after it. So the two treatments I actually got at the salon, um, the first one was called a B3 Demi Permanent Conditioner Brazilian Bond Builder, and that's just like a conditioner for your hair. It's really awesome. I really, really saw a difference in my hair compared to last time when I didn't get that treatment done and then just the Brazilian blowout. The total cost for both treatments was $350. I believe the keratin treatment was $300 and then the B3 was $50 on its own. And they do a ton of treatments there. So overall, the treatment took about, I believe it was three hours that the entire treatment took, which is pretty good. I've been to other salons and it's taken about the same time. It's because I have a lot of hair. And maybe in this video it looks almost deceiving that my hair looks almost thin, but in all actuality it's very thick and I have pretty wavy hair. So the biggest problem I have with my hair in general and the reason why I wanted this treatment is it's ultra frizzy. So as soon as I step outside, if there's even a little bit of humidity in the air, my hair just puffs right up and it takes a really long time to style, it takes a long time to blow dry. 
So I really like these treatments because it cuts down the styling time a lot and it cuts down on the frizz and it just makes my hair feel so shiny and flat to my head, which I actually like. So I initially got the treatment on February 17th, so it's almost been a month because I'm filming this on March 27th. And the reason I wanted to wait to film this is just to see how the results actually were. Also, what's interesting about this salon is it's, so they're actually a specialized salon that specializes specifically in smoothing treatments. So if you're looking to get your hair smoothed or defrizzed, um, and you're looking to get like a keratin treatment or a Brazilian blowout, this salon is going to give you amazing results because that's literally what they specialize in. They do this all day, every day. Something small, but something important to me personally because I do know about chemicals and how dangerous chemicals can be and how irritating they could be is that I will read this straight from their website. So they actually have a central fume extraction system that constantly filters the air in and out of the salon, making it the safest and most comfortable place you can experience a smoothing treatment. So basically what that means is the air is constantly filtered out. And if you guys have ever gotten like a keratin treatment somewhere where they don't have the best or most, most efficient um, system venting the air, like I've been to places where they just literally have a fan and then my eyes just start burning um, because of some of the chemicals in the treatments. But at the salon, I I didn't experience any burning. Um, she even offered me goggles if I wanted them because some people are, actually do have pretty extra sensitive eyes even if there's filtration going on. In the past I've had stylists like make comments about my hair, tell me it's like damaged and a little off-putting comments like that and no one at the salon made any comments that made me feel uncomfortable, they didn't make me feel bad for how long it took to do my hair which was nice. Also when I was in the actual salon the treatment was amazing. They had TV where you could pick like whatever Netflix show you wanted to watch. I ended up watching The Office which I thoroughly enjoyed. Another cool thing about the salon is my stylist was actually telling me they keep records of any formulas used for your hair. So if you want to book a appointment there and your favorite stylist isn't working that day, um, they'll have a record of exactly what was put in your hair and what was done to it so you can get consistent results every single time because I know it's frustrating sometimes if you want to book with your fave stylist but like they're overbooked because they're amazing um, so I really like how you can trust any stylist there is going to do a great job with your hair and then something I want to tell you guys about is actually the smooth bar was nice enough to give me a coupon code to give to any of my viewers who want to go get this treatment done. Um, if you live in LA, it's not too bad of a drive. So for any of my viewers who want to visit the smooth bar, I actually have a coupon code for you. I will put it right here. It is Amanda25. And with that code, you could either use it online or on the phone when you're booking your appointment. You guys can get $25 off of any treatment at the smooth bar. See, that's better than what you'll see on a lot of Groupon sites. So definitely check them out if you are interested in getting any of these treatment definitely use the code guys and go check them out they have two locations both in San Diego they have one in Hillcrest and they have one in Carmel Mountain Ranch which are two pretty areas so my final verdict is yes I would get this treatment again and as soon as these three months are over I 100% plan to make an appointment and go get my hair done again and just to reiterate the treatments that I got I got the Brazilian blowout and the B3 treatment which is like a deep conditioner treatment so like I said the stylist who did my hair her name is Haley and I haven't noticed my results changing or anything fishy going on so that leads me to believe that they did an amazing quality job and I would definitely recommend this place to anyone hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys have any questions or concerns in the comments below and I'll definitely make sure to address them and answer them or if you guys have any questions on my experience so thank you guys so much for watching my video and I will see you guys in the next one bye